Hello and welcome back to Cut Buzz with Nerf. Welcome back. So, um, we got a Zeta Chrome and now we're considering options for uh, a companion to throw at the golem. And uh, what else? These guys didn't, they didn't, they didn't renew. Oh, we got a box. We got to buy the box of crayons. I think they did. More shopping. Yeah, they did. Let's do it. Pentaceps. It's in the chat. It's in the chat log over there oh my god oh gigantic chem cell that could be useful i don't know that it is though <laughs> well it'll be useful for our gigantic eigen pistol true i don't, I don't actually know we if one we... of those though does it like i don't think it needs a gigantic cell though uh, that's the thing um all right if we not... find out it does i'll be very sad i didn't buy it <laughs> we were talking about going to hamel crab yeah but uh, i do think we should go visit hamiel so i it occurred to me when you said that, I mean, we can go and buy their stuff, but also, can we not have them join us? We could try. Because wouldn't Hamel Crab make a terrific golem? Maybe. Let's uh, let's see if Hamel Crab wants to join us. Uh, what was it? Abandoned. It, it was a re I'm just going to search for recoiler. Rock coil. Asphalt mines. Zip zoop. Zibbity bop. Cyclopean merchant. Also, the Dromad Trader hired guard. Lol. Oh, my God. Well, there's not really a lot going on here. I mean, Crystal Goods really shouldn't take that for granted at this point, but, I mean, it is... Yeah, only, I mean, it's a Tier 8 vendor. It's only a, a flawless Crystal. You just spend money on that. You don't need to trade. Yeah. You don't need to trade. All right, what does Hamill have? All right, so 3D Cobblers. Oh, <laughs> Carbide boots. It's probably carbide boots that we get, right? Yeah, not the gigantic slender panther. Uh, right. Um, also Molly the... netting is actually kind of silly because golems have a ridiculous carry capacity. Oh, neat. Well, what about the steel helmet? Steel helmet's probably the helmet. So we have an extra axe and sword here. We probably want mm. the uh, steel and a monk. mortar tube. <laughs> Doom. Poly polyhedral rings are really good. Yeah. Um, if we're going to try and get Hamel Crab to join us, we probably don't need to buy any yeah. of that. Well, we already have a uh, checkpoint right here. Thanks, Campfire Checkpoint. Nice. Uh, we can try proselytizing. We can't try beguiling yeah. them. Jump. Wait. Proselytize was seven earlier. All right. Oh, wow. That worked out really well. So the thing that I'm curious about, and now, now granted... <laughs> I wouldn't necessarily suggest you do this, but uh, I personally don't like um, I don't like the fact that the game doesn't really have a good follower management system right now. And there's a mod out there called Clever Girl that I highly suggest that adds a lot of really cool features for followers. Um, but what I do instead is uh, in lieu of having dominate, I'll usually just do like a swap. Mm -hmm. um in order to just check out like what the creature has right right and what it is 49 strength huh yeah it's probably oh i see you swapped like you are them now yeah i swapped into the body with a wish and now i'm gonna swap back yeah uh, uh just a word of warning uh some highly volatile shit is about to go down um your uh oh maybe not that uh, lava crab below you was enemies to you for a, a moment, and and they are still. No, they're enemies to my followers, which is funny. Wow, you got a thousand XP for nothing. Also, the, lol, yeah. magma crabs turn into like rock. Basalt. Yeah. Basalt when they die. That is really funny. Also, I, I was laughing. Uh, your the the dromad trader is also your friend, so you could probably steal from them as well if you wanted to. Yeah. I don't know about that. Let's see. Uh, yep, yep, we can. Do they have anything we really want to steal? Master I mean, Crystal Dagger probably is the only thing I would take. Yeah, that's a little bit of money. Yeah, I really, at this point. So, yeah, we probably take everything that Hamel Crab has that we want and then uh, have them become the, the golem. I sure hope... Uh, Actually, hold on. Let's just do this. I got a random idea. Oh, I hope this does not go awry. Oh, it probably will. Zoot, please, everyone, do not anger. Oh, God. The dervish is uh, probably not cool. Every, they seem okay for now. All right. Brathroom's sleeping. Everything's cool. Uh, astonishingly. 
<laughs> what if we made what if we made uh, the dromad trader <laughs> the the uh the golem so honestly hilarious I, the whole reason why i was like doing that was i wanted to tell him to stay here okay then also check on this yeah crab golem crab golem we could get a cat golem though oh that's pretty good too and it's an astral tabby or a tortoise golem we have our choices here is it going to be a normal crab or is it going to be a lava crab it'll be a normal crab ah uh, disappointing but it's still a crab golem i mean i i just love the tile for the lava crab so much mostly because i think they're are they the only tiles in the game that are symmetrical i feel like they are they might be <laughs> When I think about it, they actually kind of break a, a, a cardinal rule of cud design. The facing left and right? Yeah. yeah. Um, human golem, huh? I was just thinking if we're going to be like trying to do something with, we had long swords. Yeah. You know, uh. Can we not wear we have weapons with a, as a crab golem? Six mutation could. points. Immune to slipping plus 60% heat damage dealt. Confusion at level 10. Regeneration. 5% chance melee attacks cause a small explosion. I wonder if that hurts us. Probably does. It does. This is also a good option. Skill points are nice. Yeah. But mutation points, I think, is... Seems like a good one. Yeah. It's our Atzimus. Do we have nothing for the Atzimus? Uh, no, it's the... That would be the... Oh, the Zeta Chrome? What happened to the Zeta Chrome Longsword? You still have it in your inventory. Atzimus the... Arm the... Armament is probably oh, the... Uh, uh, oh, pa pattern trait oh, after creature part. Yeah, yeah. I need to go chop something off of someone. Oh, okay. I need an arm. Equipped with Meta Chrome long blades, incantation. Well, if we're doing long blades, um, we'll be good with long blades. Move speed's pretty good. Certainly, move speed would never be a bad thing. Yeah. 15, plus 15 quickness when you're unpaired with your golem. Does that just mean you get 15 quick? No, the golem does. Oh. Spawns with four random pieces of gigantic mid to high tier armor. Three random body parts. That one might be worth it. So like extra arms? Yeah, or extra random body parts. Spawn with four random pieces. Oh, that's not good for ecstasy. <laughs> A lot of these are same. Um... Yeah, a lot of these are the same. Um, I kind of wish that there was a way to just, like, opt to be, like... Ooh, that's not bad. Yeah. Breath to kill for Unshell comes in handy again. <laughs> kind of just uh, scrolling through these pretty quick now, because I think we've seen most of them. Yeah. If we're going for... It's like, you've already used uh, Brain Brian. I'm wondering if we want to go, like, plus 10 Ego. Potential uh, mental shenanigans. I was thinking about it. We could go shop for, like, an implant. For the Hamsa. It just occurred to me, once we start piloting this thing, you don't have to, like, we can go ruin dive with this thing, right? Yeah. Uh, that might be why, I think I understand why the larger tiles were not going to work in CUD. Plus two to all stats. For a metal folding chair? Yep. Hilarious. Give him the chair. The, um, skill points is nice. That's pretty nice. Six AB. Uh... Oh, um, I love the we could go find the the gold key. We could get phasing. I guess we could use the security card too. You have a problem is the chrome, the chrome key. key. The chrome key will lock us out of here if the door uh, ever closes. Though. Okay, fifty percent reduction to in the action cost of throw actions thing. Yeah. Box of crayons again. A cheap item gives. Plus That's two not a stats. terrible. Yeah. Oh, actually. This is reminding me. Crayon. <laughs> if, you, if you got this a second Pestle Kessel face. face, I would like, laugh my ass off. Uh, let's do dark magenta. No, I wanted to color the, the box to be purple on purple. Oh, that's funny. That was the, that was the main reason for that. So now if I leave Hamel Crab and his followers there, do the followers stay down there? Or do they come with me? Cool. Followers can stay down there. We have extra vendors at Great Gate now. Uh... We still need to go chop somebody's arm off, right? So I think how we do that is we Nanon. take our jacked Iodagon give a nanon. And then we wear them na nanon fingers. Yeah. We wear, and then we wear them nanon fingies. I'm assuming uh, what part we give it matters, like from what creature. Yeah. 
We're gonna it can win. like get uh, um, mutations that creature had. That's really fun. Stuff like that. Well, we're gonna want to use temporal fug for maximum opportunities to. Oh, I've got a really stupid idea. Um, do you wanna? <laughs> do you want the jump? Do you wanna go and find Mamon's soul drinker? <laughs> Yeah, we would probably murder Mamon at this point. Yeah, if we, did. we could break a part off him. You could try. You could just shoot him up. Yeah. I'm trying to think of like what 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 part like what it would have to be someone who's like kind of tough to break parts off of. Mamon, I don't think is like it's an unfair match. We would we would destroy them. Can we, oh, can we give the Amaranthine Prism as a, as a Hamsel? Mm, that might be funny. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta try that. We gotta. See what, see what the Amaranthine Prism gives. Plus, it's probably just plus two to all stats. Plus 20 ego minus 50 willpower. We're still lost. Lots of things going on right here that, if we don't talk, will not show up on... <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, it's not very exciting. We're fighting Neftali, and uh, I don't think we're... I don't know, did we break anything off of them? Nope. Actually, no, nah, let's just do... Let's go for... Oh, wait, hold on. Set checkpoint just in case. <laughs> uh, choose ingredients. Wild rice. Can. Cycle. Hilarious. Reveals a no. secret. I mean, I guess that's the cycle. Yeah. Sleep breath at level 10 is pretty nice. Alright, so what battery do we have in that gun? Nuclear. Nuclear. Of oh, the lucky pistol. I'm just checking to see our battery status. Yeah, alright. So we're still lost. <laughs> if only we were friends with the gulp folk, maybe they would tell us where we were. Yeah. Uh, sadly, I think the opportunity for that has long passed us. More turbos. Another turbo. EMP grenade. Do zoom. Still lost. Uh, so I wish uh, apes I, could tell you where the, where you are. Yeah, I was about to say. I wish like more things could be like. Yeah, you're uh, pretty close to the place the the people call Red Rock. I think. <laughs> um. Sure. Found another gold folk village. Let's see what's here. When we uh, when we do fight the thing we want to break parts off of, you might actually want to unequip your lucky pistol. Oh yeah, just only shoot with the uh... with nanone. Yeah. Also, the floating uh, the geomagnetic disc. I assume we we want to maximize yeah. limb rippage. It's funny because we had a, a chance to disarm. Now we have a chance to disarm. <laughs> We can show them disarm. Oh, robot? Uh, wow. Okay. Well, we can't make friends with them. Mm, no. Not easily. Not easily. I just say walk away. <laughs> wondering, yeah. I was kind of wondering why it was mad at us, but it's the Naftali. It's the Naftali and him. Yeah, it's one of the reasons I go out of my way for Naftali rep, because it makes it easier to make friends with those idols. Yeah. Pew, 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 pew. I don't think we're, like, particularly bad with Naftali. I just don't think we're good with them. They're also aggressive, as I understand. Yeah. More ruinage. Yeah, this is, uh, river ruins, which I'm probably just not going to explore. I don't feel like dealing with, uh, getting my legs chopped off. Well, I mean, uh, hear me out. What if you gave it your own leg? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. Uh, then we can get one of our own mutations. Horns? Just yeah, continue the horns. horns run. That'd be pretty good. Horned crab. Horned crab. Uh, do, 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 do. All right. So what was the quest here? For, does it tell you in the quest description or do I need to talk to him? Sure. Yeah, I think you're going to talk to him. Run eastwardly, just south of the village. All right. Ba, 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 ba. Going to the east. Pantaceps. Yeah. Where? <laughs> Along that river that we're following to go and find Mamon Soul Drinker so we may 
depart a limb from his body and give it to a golem. Just caves of cud stuff in uh, cursive font type. Well, here, let's, uh, yeah, let's... I mean, the lucky pistol is pretty cool, right? It is yeah, pretty... plus three agility. It is very cool. Too cool, in fact. We want to get rid of the geomagnetic. Or are you just trying to, like, while we're on our way, we might get lucky and rip something off someone else? I'm just practicing with it, see how often it happens, yeah. Doesn't seem to be all that often. Oh, I, we disarmed the goat folk yurt warden. Of oh, we her, disarmed. Wait, of their Issachary rifle, right. Uh, that's a shame. I forgot that that was the thing, right? That's why you said before we could disarm. Yeah, we had disarming shots, so we can disarm them, but now we can disarm them. Yeah. Yeah. And then when we're done, we'll go and give the golem disarm. Ha <laughs> ha Uh, have we yet to depart anyone of their limbs? No, but I want to look at this pistol real quick. Dismember upon penetration. 18% chance. Doesn't feel like it's doing that. Yeah, it doesn't feel 18 right now. Is that 18 before the doubleage? Should be, yeah. Or it might be showing the after double edge number there. So it's hard to say. Is it 9%? It could be 9 and then now it's 18. Yeah, we don't need any more spray foam. What? But what happens if we break our cell phone? We have five of them. <laughs> We've got an Android Galaxy 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. It's really not feeling like 20%. I guess we're missing also. There we go. Nice. What what mem what member of the disc did we get? We got a left hand. Also, um, make sure butcher is turned off. It is. Learn that the hard way. <laughs> Over encumbered. <laughs> we'll keep one hand. On hand. We'll keep one viper dagger. Uh, I don't think we ever want this again. It is such good DV. It is. But... We're twenty two DV. We don't need it. Dismembered. Yay. Which part did we cut off? Oh, we got a face. Nice. <laughs> Negative 500 reputation with the children of Mamon. We're keeping the face. I wish you... I wish one of the options on throwables was just throw. Yeah. Uh, I thought it used to be. We are dismember... Disassembling all our stuff. Oh, we just chopped off another left hand. Nice. Two left hands. Yeah. Oh, we chopped off some feet. Maybe it needed, like, warm-up time or something? I don't know. <laughs> Oof. We chopped off a tail. Go folk shaman's tail. That's fun. That's kind of really heavy, though. Yeah, well, I mean, all the body parts are five, I think. We do have a lot of overloaded pistols that I would maybe recommend taking a moment to disassemble. If the system isn't showing them to me yet. What do we pick up? Oh, sower seeds. And, uh, ooh, we there. finally found it. Yes. Uh, the question is now, though, I think we should wait and chrome the golem instead of ourselves. Can we do both? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if you can do both. I'm sure we can, but we'll, I, I'm, I'm cool with that, if you want to wait. I mean, that was kind of the whole idea, the secret from way back at the beginning. Yep, that was the whole reason we have two heads. Yeah, though it's come in better handy with the new helmet we found. Yep. Kind of want to... Let's just disassemble it. Uh oh, silver nugs. What could, are these? We could preserve those. Those are for Maglash. Ah, yeah. 16 servings of Maglash. I keep saying mag lash instead of mashed lag. Nice. That is not intended. More turbos. Turbo. Turbo with the turbo. Also notice how the turbo isn't so turbo when there's all this water around. Yeah. Oh, holy shit. We found out something new. 
Ixermoth the Third won a decisive victory against the combined forces of the Glass Glories district of Bemurata, the bloody battle of Shirkapad Hollow. He lost his prized flame six sided during the course of the conflict, and as a result of the battle, Shirkapad Hollow was so wide with bad omens that it was renamed the Lucky Marsh. Lucky Marsh? Yeah, because it was the, so bad. It's the ironic naming scheme again. Mm -hmm. What was that thing before? It was like, um,. There was a marsh that was like so rife with terrible visages that it was named like Blessed Marsh or something. Yeah. Stupid trees, get out of our way, yeah. trees. Ah. <laughs> we must be getting pretty close. Nice. What do we get? Face a face. We got another face. We're getting lots of goat folk parts. Oh, that that lucky uh, unlucky soldier got two parts knocked yeah. off him. Yeah, no, he got he got a little. He lost his left. He lost both his left hands. <laughs> that or he had another friend who was standing near him that also lost a hand. We're famished and inspired. We are, and we're shooting dot vectors, dismembering everybody. So it, it does feel actually pretty likely that we will get some piece of Mamone. Heck yeah. All right. Uh, I know we are... Um, inspired? Inspired already. However, I kind of just want to do this. Yeah, that makes sense. Just in case, because we're probably getting pretty close. Although that was one of my mushrooms. It, it's going to be good safety. And now we should just kind of rush the rest of the. Still not I think there. We got two more to go. Kind of wondering why Mamone's Soul Drinker doesn't get killed by the Amaranthine Prism. Uh, I think kind of the, I don't know. Like my my internal explanation for it is that it's just um. He hasn't had it long enough. Yeah, I figured that was, but you know, time is time is passing as we are playing this game. I feel like uh, you could do uh, you could have like a Metal Gear Solid situation where if you play the game long enough, he's just a corpse. Yeah. You find him and he's already dead. Collapsed under the weight of his own ego. Where is he? Man. I could have sworn we were much closer. No, not yet. I think we are getting close though. Yeah. Can't cook with hostiles nearby. At a checkpoint there. Well, he just wasted his uh his business on um that leech. No parts yet. There we go. There's oh, we the got money. Mamone's face. Oh heck yeah. There's the money. Oh we got another part. Feet. We could make a Quentin Tarantino golem. I'm just gonna keep going. Can't let anyone else get my kill on Mamone. All right. Nice, nice, increased. Oh, this is, I'm actually really excited for this. Carrying too much, too much stuff. Don't forget, don't forget his face and limbs. Yeah. <laughs> we need those. That's uh, one of the, uh, no, it's not even, not even a plus two ego face. Wait, is that what happens to the um, golem when you wear it? Um, if you get a higher level one, it's probably worth more. Usually, I don't know if we need Mamone's feet. I mean, I, I really don't know what. I haven't ever played with the golem that hard to know what the difference between each limb is going to be. So let's just bring a bunch of limbs over to the. All right, let's go back to Gookgate. Check in with our friends over at the Golem creation table and see what happens. Wait, why is Hamel Crab an X? That's weird. Huh? Hmm. Yeah. Oh, it's. I think it's still a relatively fresh feature. Ooh, okay. Uh, it's okay. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? It'll just give us, like, some of their... Like, this is almost the best one we ever... Actually. Well, yeah... Temporal few get level six. Come on. Either one of those is okay, right? 
Um, yeah, we can't, like, would our Axe of Temporal Fugue level 3 affect the Golem? No, because it can't equip it, because right. it's not gigantic. But, still, but I think this is our best face yeah, I, I would agree. Situation. I'm a little sad that we got, like, a legendary kind of face, and it didn't really do much. So you were wondering, I think it's probably going to be at the bottom. Yeah, I'm definitely wondering about the Am Amaranthine Prism. Plus 6 AV. God, that is so boring Yeah. for what that item is. Um, but still... Like I, I said, some things are specialized, some things aren't. No, I know. I, I'm not... Yeah. Uh, no, no, it's not a criticism on uh, in any shape, way, shape, or form. I'm, I, uh, I just like... Uh, there's no way it was going to be worth it, but it was still going to be... I was still, I still had some hope it was going to be something ridiculous, like extra ego. Yeah, put all of our extra parts in there. Plus six uh, AV wouldn't be terrible anyway. We might as well give that back to uh, yeah. Indrix for some extra XP. <laughs> Indrix is just like, hey, you got the Amaranthine Prism. Cool. You didn't try and like build a golem with it or anything, right? That would be really messed up if you did that at all. Choose a reward. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's just hilarious. We should take something that we can actually put in the golem. Like if we took a flaming full right dagger, I bet that would count. I, I the thermo cask is hilarious. Don't don't get me wrong. I mean, it's also a six bit. Yeah, we don't really need. A six -bit. Nah, we don't really need six bits, but let's do it. You gotta you gotta put it on though. But that's. That's going to get rid of our electrical generation. No, I mean, put it on just to, just oh, to, just to see the dis just to see the disguise for a moment. Yeah, you passed uh, it already. We could actually hold on. Overburdened. OK, is it only Hamel Crab that's still here? No, no the Arch Dervish and the Dromad Trader are still here. <laughs> Luminous Wait. Mushroom cannot. Come. Why did I end up? <laughs> uh, yeah, nothing interesting on him. All right, so. Arch Dervish of the Sightless Way and Hired Guard. Chat. Trade. Where is it? Thermo Cask and 80 disguise. Oh, that's really... That's funny. Oh, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> uh, That's really good. Rename them. Oh, you, I thought we, you could rename them just like Adai. Adai, yeah, don't worry have. about it. Yeah. All right. Um, did we want to complete the golem or did we want to, uh, end it here and see what we can see on the next one? Uh, I think we should go explore around in the moon stair and other areas a bit because basically when it comes to like the body parts, like we should just keep bringing back some until we're like, oh, that would make a funny golem. Yeah. And there we go. You know what I mean? I'm down for that. Like the body part that we have right now. Fugue or Quills is okay. I think Fugue with a Golem is pretty good. Yeah. Um, fugue with a Golem is pretty silly. Also, if we gave it if we plus, could get plus fugue more ego. Only, right? Oh, you mean like, is it random what will what it will get? Well, when it says or, yeah. Oh, that's a bummer. Yeah. Okay. I'm really trying to parse out what the tile is for the mound of scrap. It's a mound of scrap and clay. Yeah. All right. If you are enjoying this series, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more of this. We'll see you next time as we build ourselves a golem and I'm also explore. Butt with NARF. <laughs> Cud butt with NARF. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. What is your favorite face to put on, <laughs> on a golem?